New tonight at 9 o'clock in Austin ISD mother is angry and sad after police say a school bus driver sexually abused her daughter on board the bus. Since 6 o'clock tonight, we've learned from the mother it was a bus for special needs children. The district says that suspect, Cesar Maldonado, confessed to the crime. He drove an AISD school bus for 10 years. KXAN education reporter Aaron Cargill live with our top story. Robert, I talked to the mother of this five-year-old little girl for about 30 minutes tonight. At times, she was in tears, telling me she trusted this bus driver. She didn't want to go on camera, but she wanted me to share her thoughts and concerns with you in hopes this arrest will stop this from happening to anyone else's child. A week before school starts, parents learning disturbing accusations about a former Austin ISD bus driver. A mother says now she knows why her five-year-old daughter would start crying every morning before getting on the bus. She says she saw Cesar Maldonado put her child, a pre-K student, at Uphouse Early Childhood Center on his lap and let her pretend she was driving the bus. Next, her daughter came home and said Maldonado touched her where he shouldn't. Austin ISD police say footage on cameras inside the bus matched the little girl's story. The girl's mother also says her daughter has a speech problem and believes it made her even more of a target. She also questions why the bus monitor left her daughter alone with the driver. As long as there's one adult in the bus, uh, I do know that uh, uh, the aides at some points have to um, leave the bus to escort other students to the, sc to the school uh, and come back. After 10 years driving a bus for AISD, we also asked police if they believe Maldonado has done this before. At this point, no other complaints have been received, but we do encourage parents if they have questions or concerns about Mr. Maldonado or, uh, or the safety of their children to please bring it to their attention and contact the police department. And some parents showed up to a meeting here at Uphouse tonight where the district tried to answer questions about the situation. I also want to let you know all AISD buses have four cameras inside and they should be rolling at all times when the bus is on. The little girl's mother told me that she believes those cameras didn't capture the right angle to see exactly what Maldonado was doing. She'd like to see that change and she'd like to see the district add even more cameras inside. Back to you. Aaron, thank you. Today, Austin ISD's police chief told us that bus drivers go through rigorous training and background checks, but we got a better idea of the steps AISD takes from the last time a bus driver was accused of sexual assault. In 2015, Leon Young was charged with sexually assaulting a six-year-old. His trial is scheduled to start next month. Shortly after his arrest, an AISD spokesperson told us they have a system that monitors daily if there are any arrests or convictions of its drivers. The district also randomly drug test drivers every three weeks, and they're telling us that all bus drivers are trained to understand what's appropriate or inappropriate touching. And just like today, the bus driver charged with sexual assault in 2015 had no criminal history.